Hi Deck Gang, Liam here. There is a new update to Proton Experimental available for running Windows games on Linux and Steam Deck. And so here's a look at what's new. This Proton Experimental update went up on July 7th, 2022, and the newly playable title should include Aquarist My First Job, Trove, Disgaea 5, and Plants vs Zombies Godden Warfare 2 Deluxe Edition. They also fixed an experimental regression that made Monkey Island 2 Special Edition LeChuck's Revenge unplayable. They fixed Hardspace Shipbreaker failing to connect to online services, and another experimental regression was solved that made Uno unplayable. To use Proton Experimental, here's how to do it on Steam Deck. Just pick a game, Go to the cog icon on the far right, select properties, then go to the compatibility menu, tick that box and select it from the drop down and then you are done. Easy as that. To show the changes in action, I'm going to leave you with some footage of Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare 2 that I recorded directly today from my Steam Deck. Out of the box, it works really well with all of the defaults and it performs pretty much at 60 frames a second all the time, apart from a couple little dips here and there. That's on the defaults. However, you won't get a lot of battery life out of that, so I would recommend just locking the screen down to 40 hertz. You'll probably save a bit of battery life there and it'll still look great.
Oh. Um. 